typical training week for myself, I would be doing weights between six, about six times a week, um, so splitting up all my muscle groups. Also, if I'm coming towards competition, I'd be doing cardio first thing in the morning. That would be a power walk for about half hour to 45 minutes if I can handle it, depending on my energy levels. Um, after my weight training, which I do sort of mid-afternoon time, I'd be adding on sort of 20 minutes to half hour cardio after that as well. If you're getting very close to competition, say like two weeks before, and I think I still need to lose a bit more body fat, I may even add another half hour cardio last thing at night. So it does start, the cardio does really pick up. If it's outside a competition, however, that is your, more your bulking phase, you're trying to build the muscle, um, I would do cardio maximum three times a week, um, just 20 minutes after um, three of my weight training sessions. I tend to try and split my muscle groups as much as possible. Um, it's, for instance, my legs, I'll work my quads one day, that can take me up to an hour to do that. Um, then another day I work my hamstrings and glutes. So I used to do it all at one, but it just used to take too long. Um, I'll work chest, chest on their own, sometimes add a bit of triceps in with that. Um, what I work back on its own and sometimes biceps with that. Other days I may just do biceps and triceps separately. Um, every other day I, I do work abs. When it's, when it's outside a competition, I'll do more interval training, just three times a week, um, 20 minutes worth. So, but actually, it may only be five minutes worth of interval within that 20 minutes. Um, however, if it's closer to competition, it will be really low level, like power walking. So that's just, just helping to burn the body fat. It is a good way to burn the body fat, but you can't do that all the time because, again, your body does get used to it. So if people are doing power walking think it's gonna burn body fat for a year, that's not gonna happen. You just always need to shock the body, so that's why I'm doing the interval outside of, you know, in the bulking phase, and then, and then you're power walking when I'm really dieting hard. Um, I do use cross trainer, cross trainer's good, um, because that's very good for um, well, the, the interval side of it. Um, power walking with a bit of an incline, um, also stepper as well, stepper is good, but I don't actually do any running whilst, because that that's, burns, burns the muscle too much.